My name is Matthew Clark and I play Mickey Rose. I found out about the Horizon series um, through my agent who sent me the audition and uh, I read the, the material that came through and uh, obviously seen the challenge in it and um, was willing to put myself forward for it. I see the challenge in um, the, the subject matter um, and the, the kind of, uh, the struggle between um, the parallels of my life and my character's life, uh, being me straight and my character being gay. And I was obviously willing to put myself into that perspective and see where it took me. Paul Layton, who plays Jake in the series, is um, a great actor and we both realised that to give the material kind of its, its, um, its power and potential was by finding the underlying meanings between the characters and the, and the relationships. And um, I think for me to get into that role, it was very beneficial working through the scripts with him and figuring out our processes and where we really wanted to take the scene and the characters. And uh, yeah, that I think came out pretty well in the end result. So do you think you guys have a good chemistry on screen? Yeah, definitely got a good chemistry on scene. EPK bomb! <laughs> 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 um, yeah, we've definitely got a great chemistry on screen. I think that, that came, came from both of us um, realizing how hard the material was um, going from a heterosexual person into, you know, the gay scene, uh, we both really tried to find that underlying meaning, that love between the two characters instead of just the physical side of things. I watched a bit of it and I realised where the, where the um, Horizons was going and I seen the potential in it and I think I didn't really focus so much on that. I focused on what was put in front of me, the material in front of me and how I could give that its most justice and whether that was better or worse or Whatever it was, it didn't really bother me. I was just all about the project there and then. Have I been getting much feedback on social media? Yes, I have. I've, um, I get quite a few Facebook friend requests um, and a lot of personal messages, um, which are all supportive. And um, phew, I can't be more grateful for them. It makes, me, um, it makes me really passionate about what I'm doing and um, it spurs me on to you know, go, go better and harder for the next one. He has obviously gone through a massive roller coaster in the last season. So this one is more him uh, kind of balancing his life out and getting the fundamentals right as in work relationship and uh, really taking on his new, his new lifestyle with the news that he's been given. My research into my character contracting HIV, um, I was very lucky with um, Akon giving me the resources I needed to figure out the processes um, for diagnosed HIV patients and uh, the process that they need to go through. Um, they were so supportive and the information that I was given through them um, kind of took away all the question marks that I had about it and uh, obviously helped me realise that it wasn't a... Um, like a, you know, it wasn't a life or death situation. There was life outside of that. And that's what Mickey really had to go through and um, kind of understand as, as his character. So to have that information as an actor helps so much with, with the script because you know where you're taking it. And um, yeah, it was, it was amazing. It was amazing. Um, Horizontal fans, thank you so much for all your support. It's amazing. And uh, for, for all the comments and um, the, the feedback that you give us is unbelievable and so supportive and it definitely spurs all of us on to keep going. So thank you, Horizontals. <laughs>